Erica Jane was seen with a very expensive designer handbag just weeks after auctioning off many luxury goods in order to pay down her estranged husband Tom Gerardus' enormous $101 million bankruptcy debt. The 51-year-old Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star lugged along a black lambskin leather quilted large Chanel shopping bag which retailed for about $7,000, on a casual outing in Los Angeles on Wednesday. She teamed the luxury leather good with a pink and white blouse, black joggers, and white sneakers. Erica chatted away on her mobile phone as she accessorized with black designer cat eye shades. Her signature platinum blonde locks were worn in a messy bun as her makeup was completed with a swipe of nude lip. Last month Erica's luxury lifestyle was sold off piece by piece at a recent auction aimed at raising funds to pay down her estranged husband's massive debt. John Moran auctioneers ran a dual online and in-person auction of pieces from the couple's former life together on September 21st and raked in roughly $500,000, according to TMZ at the time. Tom Girardi, whom Erica is currently divorcing, has an estimated debt of more than a $100 million and is in bankruptcy. The former attorney is also in the midst of several other legal battles in connection with allegedly pilfering millions of dollars from his clients. Erica Jane's champagne taste has been flaunted during her seasons on The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. Many items from her Pasadena mansion were put on the auction block and 253 pieces were sold for a total of $493,641, according to TMZ. The outlet reported that the highest ticket pieces included a J. Seward Johnson Jr. bronze sculpture. $13,750, a black lacquered cabinet with mythological oil paintings, $11,875, a black lacquered chinoiserie style console table with gilt highlights, $10,000, and two Michael Taylor Montecito outdoor garden armchairs, $7,150. Additionally, a 1993 Spalding NBA Finals ball signed by Michael Jordan sold for $4,688. The money raised at the auction will go towards paying on the dozens of debtors to whom Girardi owes money. Late last week, the 51-year-old Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star was removed as a defendant from a suit originally filed against her and her estranged husband Tom Girardi, 83, according to Southern California's City News Service. The couple were being sued over attorney's fees that Girardi's law firm alleged failed to pay to a team of lawyers that worked together with it on a case. Los Angeles Superior Court Judge Richard L. Fruin had previously ruled in late August that Jane should be removed as a defendant, but on Friday he signed a judgment affirming that ruling. He determined in the course of the lawsuit that the reality star had no actual knowledge of Girardi's firm's alleged wrongdoing. The day before the judge signed his order dismissing Jane, the plaintiffs also dropped complaints against her company Edge Global LLC. The case was originally brought by the attorneys Philip Hart, Sheldon and Robert P. Finn and their law firms. They claim that Girardi and his law firm Girardi and Key owe them attorneys fees from collaborative work. Sheldon and Finn worked together with Girardi and Keese in 2008 and 2009 on personal injuries lawsuits alleging that the plaintiffs were exposed to dangerous chemicals from cement manufacturing plants. Sheldon, Finn and Girardi and Keese allegedly had agreements with the plaintiffs in writing that their firms would share attorneys' fees. After the original lawsuit was settled for $31 million, Sheldon and Finn claim that Girardi and Keese never gave them their share of the attorney's fees. 
The attorneys took Girardi and Jane to court in December 2020 for $900,000 in damages, as well as punitive damages. However, a sticking point with Jane's attorneys was whether the alleged agreement to split the fees was put into writing, or if it was merely a verbal agreement. They claimed that Sheldon and Finn's suit doesn't clarify the nature of the agreement. In court filings, Jane's attorneys defended her, noting that she is not an attorney and therefore claiming that she did not work with her ex on the case. They also claimed that she knew nothing of the original case, and added that her career in music and reality television wouldn't have given her knowledge or experience with the subject. I was completely unaware of, did not participate in and did not provide any assistance of any nature regarding any conduct or scheme by anyone, including Girardi and Keese and Tom Girardi, with the object or goal of harming plaintiffs or depriving plaintiffs of money that plaintiffs claimed was due to them, read a statement Jane gave under oath in a motion for dismissal. Jane has repeatedly defended herself and denied knowledge of Gerarda's potential wrongdoings. She has been involved in significant litigation related to claims that Gerardi allegedly schemed to bilk the families of the victims of the 2018 Lion airplane crash in Indonesia out of millions of dollars that were owed to them. Another lawsuit against Erica previously claimed that her company Edge Global was created for the purpose of funneling money from, Tom Girardi's law firm, Girardi Keys to benefit Erica. The songstress has been required to return some of the pricey gifts that her estranged husband gave her in order to help compensate victims of the crash. However, she has continued to defend herself and claims to have been uninvolved and unaware of her then-husband's alleged misdeeds, 